What's up guys, I'm at SHOT Show at Magpool once again. And uh, you probably saw this at Media Day, but uh, I got Jake here. He's gonna talk about him real quick and tell you what he's got. All right, so um, we have five total models in our eyewear line, but uh, yeah, we're really new excited. for 2019, we have the uh, Magpul Explorer XL. Um, ballistic rating is Z87.1. High end price will be 149, and then low end price will be 99 dollars. Um, kind of a Wayfair esque design. Um, it's the larger version of our current Explorer. Uh, multiple lens colors and um, multiple frame colors, black and tour. Nice. The radius is uh, probably our most, um, it, it's kind of the model that we're looking forward to. Z87 plus rating, it'll come in uh, black and FDE frame. It'll be offered in clear and gray lens as well, kind of built for your shooter. For the oh, shooter okay, line, so right? it's essentially a safety glass. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yep. Okay, yeah. Z87 plus ballistic rating, and, and like all of our models, they all come in the uh, DACA can. Uh, it's typically a black, black uh, uh, case that comes with all of our pieces and a, uh, a cleaning cloth. Uh, not to geek out too much on that uh, ballistic rating, but can you kind of explain to the guys what's entailed in that exactly? Yeah, so, so any, anytime you're actually trying to build like basically a mil spec sunglass, right, or protective eyewear, um, the lenses have to meet certain specifications. They're shot with a projectile. What is that? What is that projectile? Do you know? uh, it's a 1.5. So it's kind of like a bird shot kind of thing? Yeah. It's oh, okay. a regular shaped projectile. Oh, okay. Right? okay. So they shoot them all the way up to the their failure point. Okay. So lenses are built to a certain thickness and they're, mm -hmm. they're there to withstand or protect your eyes. From gotcha. Any shrapnel or debris mm -hmm. issues. So ours are, have passed upwards or 700 feet per second plus. Oh wow. Which is well beyond the current uh, mil spec specifications. Mm -hmm. um, and then, you know, what we do is we just use all of that material, all those, nice. those lens material in all of our glasses. Nice. So we don't change it um, according to what model we actually using. Uh, you know, another thing I was wondering too is because I actually wear glasses too all yeah, yeah, the time, yeah. um, but I have prescription glasses. Yep. So yeah. is there like a recommendation as far as getting prescription done? So the way it works is that the flatter the, the sunglass, yeah. the flatter the frame, the more prescription you can have. Right? So if you have a basically like a flatter pair, you can get anything from extremely corrective to maybe minor corrections, right? The higher wrap you get, it kind of limits the amount of uh, oh, okay. uh, prescriptions that you can have or, or the amount of correction that you can have in your lens, right? I think there's so a couple companies that specialize in yeah. shooting. What's that? Yeah, they do. Yeah, 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 exactly. Um, and, you know, most of our frames are, are uh, RX compatible. Oh, okay. uh, it's just up to you to, you know, take them and get off and put in. All right, uh, before we go, let's, let's have you model it on your face and then give us the give us the website for more information. Yeah, so these are the, uh, <laughs> the Explorers with the uh, bronze, bronze lens and the mirror coating the tortoise. Yeah. So they look looking all right? Oh yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, and they're all available yeah. at Magpool.com. Magpool.com, yeah. easy peasy, right on. Right. Thanks a lot, Jake. Yep, thanks man. Let's go check out what's going on at Magpool. Of course they always have a lot of stuff to check out. There's their precision rifle. What's over here? Original Magpul mold. Oh, look at that. That's cool. That was when they uh, had the rubber bands you put around the bottom of the magazine. There's their drum mag. Ooh, that's for uh, 308. Nice. There's their uh, HK stuff. Uh, they got tons of HK stuff. Oh, nice. Look at that. Very cool. There's a more uh, um, Hunter American. There's the CZ stuff. So this is what we saw at Media Day. They had some of this stuff laying out there. Uh, some guys were shooting. I didn't get a chance to shoot it, but yeah, they got their uh, magazines. Finally, that's awesome. I'm sure a lot of the CZ guys are gonna love that. They're gonna love that. And then uh, obviously they got the uh, Magpul grip. Well, I mean, there's no danger. That is nice, man. And also they have a Magpul magazine release as well. Very nice. CZ sales are going to go up. There's going to be a spike in CZ sales for sure now. 